after the sake and the ramen and the ice cream and um, let me tell you it was good but like my stomach hurts okay so I woke up early because my bowels were like you gotta get this <laughs> I was about to say get this shit moving <laughs> but I mean yeah okay so let me stop being gross um so today's Wednesday, May 26th. It's also the last day that my nephew had school. Um, if you don't know, my nephew has been doing online schooling this entire year. So he did his entire fifth grade year online. And I'm not going to lie and say like it was easy, but because it was not for him, you know. Um, but yesterday we, actually right before I went on my date with George, I turned in the last... Um, the last assignment he had to do um, for this grading period. Um, he already did his star test. I had to take him into an actual school in his um, neighborhood where he lives to take the test. And <laughs> I'm gonna start crying again. <sighs> My sister, his mother, obviously, just texted us this morning and said that his teacher, she had a meeting with his teacher, with his teachers, and he has, he's a sixth grader, like, he passed, and that just makes me so unbelievably happy because, what is that little boy doing? Anyways, because, um, you know, we were worried, you know, that he was, he might have to, um, go to summer school, which, you know, isn't that terrible, you know, we, we would have understood it because he did it, he did all fifth grade online, mainly by himself, so, you know, it's just some extra learning, and then cool, you're past the next grade, but, um, but I, like, we have, um, a beach house planned, my family likes to do this every summer, we'll get, like, We'll all pitch in on a beach house and this time it's like right on the water and I know he's just gonna be so happy to just like you know like not have to worry about anything and it makes me emotional cuz like <sighs> because he basically did that you know like all on his own like I've only been helping him these past couple of like weeks or like this past month or something um, and you know Man, it's just like, it's crazy because he's not even like my child, but I just feel like so proud of him and just like, like so much relief for him and, you know, like he basically did this shit on his own, you know? Yeah, so I've been, like, <laughs> doing this all morning, <laughs> but, um, yesterday, before he went to bed, he was like, can we do something tomorrow? And I was like, yeah, let's see, let's see about the weather. I also wanted to check, make sure they didn't assign him any more work, but I don't think they are. Um, I think this is, like, the last day for kids to work on their assignments that has been assigned this past week, but... We finished ours. Every every subject is done, which I'm really happy about. I'm glad we did that. Um, or he did that. I just told him when to do it. <laughs> and I, I gave him the little help that he needed. So I think right now we're going to go swimming. I'm whispering because I don't know if he's awake. <clears throat> so I went on to go jump on his bed. And celebrate and then um, I also wanted to um, tell him let's go wake up granny and tell her um, which is my grandmother um, so 
she has no worry and then also they can actually i'm gonna make coffee first because i know my grandma's gonna be like i need coffee so i'm gonna make some coffee and then i'm gonna go jump in his bed and then i'll tell him like you're a sixth grader and i'm gonna record i'm gonna record it because like how am i not gonna record this like this is never gonna happen again like he's literally growing up oh my god <laughs> but like I love him this age and I love him little but like imagining him like a young man like makes me so happy you know like from here on out like you know from like elementary school you kind of have to like listen to what like people around you tell you but like from here on out he's able to express himself freely and just experiment with his style and his way of thinking and his beliefs and I'm just excited to see what kind of person he is but that's that's for later on he's barely on the sixth grade why am I freaking out I don't know I'm gonna go make coffee bye <laughs> Jump on the bed and celebrate. No! Why? I'm tired. Oh, well then, I was going to take you somewhere, but I guess okay, if you're tired. Okay, you're going right now. Okay, then you got to jump on the bed with me. Okay. Like, actual jumping? Yeah, wait, I need to hang on to the wall. Woo! What if we break it? Doesn't matter. You're not going to break it. Yeah. <laughs> Stop fucking you. Okay. <laughs> Okay. I was on my trampoline, I would do this thing I would always do. I'm laying on my back and, and it would bounce me right back up and I'd lay on my back. The back bounce? Yes. <laughs> and the butt bounce. That seems like I could do it on the bed. Okay. Dang. I think Granny's asleep. She is. So let's go wake her up. And scream! No, not scream. Let's not scream. <laughs> scream. No, not scream. <laughs> but we'll wake her up. And she'll, be, she'll probably be happy because you're waking her up. And then you'll be like, Granny. Tell her. I'm gonna go to a victory tear back or something. Okay, yeah, in the living room. So I wanted to take him to my mom. What's good, y'all? I have been on my bullshit. Sorry. But I have not been productive. I've been helping my nephew with school and. After that, because he's done with school now, he passed. Everybody shout him out in the comments, like, woo! And to every every person who has passed and is moving on to their next school year or semester, whichever it may be, I'm proud of you. Anyways, I need to be productive, so let's let's be productive, okay? I need to do a lot of things. So yeah, I've been doing like stuff around the house. Been growing some new acne. Love that. Um, and I just got, uh, yes. And then I got a, um, like a fruit tea with rainbow jellies in it. Yeah. Did it give me hot sauce? But they did give me, um, dang, I forget what this sauce is called. It's not, s I don't think it's spicy. Actually, it might be. Because I see, like, red and brown in it. We shall see. Okay, I'm gonna eat. Hello! I am very red right now. <sighs> it's been a long day, guys. I've been doing a lot of just cleaning and, um, decorating <laughs> running errands mm -hmm. um what I'm about to paint that's why 
have this set up. Sorry if you can hear the AC. It's getting hot in Texas, y'all. It's getting hot. But yeah, I'm about to paint this pot for my grandmother. And we're just going to do white all over. So this should be pretty easy. So um, let's do a little montage of it. My pot is drying right now. I did the first coat of white, um, but George just got home and we spontaneously decided to go get ramen. So I'm just gonna put on a little bit of makeup and we're gonna go eat some yummy, I don't know what I'm gonna get actually. I usually get the same thing, but I'm kind of feeling adventurous. So let's go. Summer is definitely approaching. Well, oh, I just want to tell you guys that I'm going to be repotting this ivy. Just ignore the background. Yeah, follow me on TikTok if you want to see what's going on. Um, yeah, follow me on TikTok. <laughs> 